What's up, guys? Um, first off, I want to let you know beef prices way up, guys. Um, per pound of filet mignon is now thirty thirty dollars a pound. <clears throat> Um, and that's the highest they said they've ever seen, um, that be. Now, other cuts I'm not sure of, um, I haven't heard, but I haven't gone to the store in a while either, so I don't know what's gone up and what has not. <clears throat> um, so, be aware, um, lots of things are going up, and I've said that before, um, I've prepared, hopefully you guys have, um, you know, I got a can, two pounds of ground beef in a can, you know, I got chicken in a can, I got the, the tuna fish, I've got other chicken, you know, uh, Kirtland stuff, um, salmon in the can, um, best bet guys is probably fish, seafood, <clears throat> that kind of stuff, um, because I don't see that going up right now. Um, other foods, other meat. Yeah, I mean, so we're probably going to be switching over to chicken and um, fish. So, uh, something to think about there. <clears throat> you still get your, your staples, your rice, your beans, your peas. Um stuff like that that you can have um, to make soups, um, side dishes, you know, beans or protein. So that's, you know, good stuff too. Um, what else? <clears throat> um, you know, always have a stock of everything that you, that you use. Um, have a backup. Um, have two backups, three backups, four, whatever. Whatever you can afford, get what you can, because um, the more you have for later, uh, when it gets really bad, <clears throat> is better than starving, having to eat half portions, um, things like that. If you got kids, guys. It's not going to be good if they're they're hungry and so forth because their health declines. Uh, they get very irritable. Um, then you start getting into um, that real stuff. You know, lack of waters. You know, just a lot of stuff, guys, <clears throat> um, that you need to think about. So. <clears throat> um, that's it. Had a new air conditioner put in on Saturday. Did good. Saturday night yesterday was okay. I mean, it was cold when I got in. Last night, it didn't look like it was working very well. And this morning, I woke up and the line was froze again, just like it did on the old unit. So, they're coming back out today between 1 and 6 to figure out what's going on. So, hopefully, get this fixed because... Woke up, it was like 71, almost 72 in my room. And I'm like, no, 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 this is not good. Usually if I have it set down to 66 like I did, you know, to cool it off, 68, um, it's normal, quite cool in that room. So anyway, hope we get that fixed. But uh, that's about it, guys. I will talk to you later. It is June 7th. Yesterday was D-Day. Hope you all remembered that. Um, uh, that's about it. So, talk to you later, guys. Peace out. Love you. Bye.